Day 1 action in Champaign, our area wrestlers have their hands full. That includes Naperville Central's Ben Williamson. His first wrestleback match at 138 is against Kerry Grove's John Cullen. Both of these guys lost to Lockport's Shane Oster. Williamson up 1-0 near the end of the first period. He goes for the double leg. Cullen tries to do something with it, but the takedown points are awarded. Williamson goes up 3-0, wins 3-1. On day two, he loses just a match short of a medal match. DJ Workenthey represents Niqua at the state finals. This 195-pound wrestleback match comes against Sandberg's Cole Bateman. Early first, Workenthey is aggressive. He goes on to take a 4-2 lead after the first with two double-leg takedowns. Now up 7-2 in the second period. Yes, another double-leg. 16-8, major decision to move on. He ends up tweaking an injury and has to forfeit his fifth-place match against Wabonzi's Max Irie. So how does Irie get there? Well, here's part of the journey. First wrestleback match isn't much of a problem. He turns a single leg of Manuka's Joshua Bowie into a takedown on his way to a 10-2 major decision. Again, he takes fifth place on day two. Also taking fifth place in his respective weight class is Naperville North's Chris Zhang at 220 pounds. But back on day one, he has a tight one against Lockport's Chris Marino. Zhang up 2-1 after a period. In the second, Zhang's now up 3-2. He can use some breathing room. This does the trick. He flips around control to the back and gets his two reversal points, 5-2 after that. Also the final score, teammate Stevie Schmoltz just misses out on a medal at 160, as does Matias Keenan-Carter at 145.